it's Jay and welcome back to my channel or if you've just found me hello I am wearing a hat indoors only because my hair looks a disgrace so uh, I'm not going to show that and I hope everyone is good and feeling Christmassy because I know I'm not <laughs> that's why I wanted to come on here and do like a quick video for you guys because I know I haven't posted since my last video which was I think about three weeks ago I don't know what it is I just Physi sometimes physically I don't feel good and then recently mentally I've just been feeling crap um, I don't know if it's this time of year or it's because it's cold or it's just how the, the weather makes me feel I honestly don't know I've just not been feeling Christmassy at all like I really I know I'm probably gonna get a lot of hate on this video because yes I know we've all had a bad year and Christmas should be cheering everyone up and da -da, but like I think it is because of th this year that the run up to Christmas, I've just been thinking, well, loads of other stuff's gonna go wrong, so I don't want to celebrate Christmas. We we can't like see some. Well, we can see family, but at a limited thing. We can't play board games and stuff that you would do at Christmas. They're saying don't play board games, don't stay over, and I, that was like the whole fun and, and the whole point of Christmas. I understand that that they're wanting us to be safe, but then it's not gonna be like a normal Christmas. So I've just not been feeling very Christmassy at all like I've got some stuff like our stuff's up around the house we haven't put our tree up yet because we wait till like the middle of December to do that we always have um and then men and then physically I've just been feeling so exhausted like winter is the worst time for someone like me that has sciatica and fibromyalgia because my back is starting to hurt more I'm scared that if I bend down I'm going to lock my back and if I lock my back I cannot walk for two weeks literally cannot stand up straight I'm literally hunched over like freaking Igor like like that like it, it's not it doesn't look good and then fibro i like for some strange reason i've been getting at least two migraines a week so i've been stuck in bed in a in a freaking dark room nothing like bored out my mind not, i can't sleep i've not been going to sleep till like three o'clock in the morning some night some nights half three half three i'm lying in bed like my brain is like wired like i've had 10 million cups of coffee and i'm ready to run a marathon and do all this and it's just exhausting this year's been crap i know it's been crap and Christmas should be of like it's Christmas but we all know it's not going to be like any normal Christmas that we we can only we can see people but only for a limited amount of time and we can only have a few certain people so I don't know I'm just not feeling Christmassy at all I just I guess wanted to come on here and explain that to you guys why I've not posted and stuff just because all, all that really but I hope like everyone else is having a good um is getting ready and having Christmas spirit you know um I have nearly got all my presents I'm one that people I'm one of those people that um leaves getting christmas presents till end of november near start to mid-december i'm never early for christmas because after on what of october and how november i'm still kind of in halloween mode till the middle of november and then it slides into christmas for me so i, I still keep being in i'm in halloween mode all year but october from like october to like mid-november is when i'm full-blown halloween and i just it won't go away um but I have bought most of my presents. I haven't wrapped any of them yet. I still need to get little bits and bobs in there. Me and my sis, me and my sister, are just working together this year. And like after the past couple of years, we've just bought presents separately. But this year, we're because of obviously all the circumstances and people not having money and like people and we just thought we would go together and like join presents up. So I'm buying one thing, she's buying another thing, and then we're just gonna put them all together, which is fine. Probably will tonight start looking at wrapping some because I've got a couple thing a couple people are all finished so i might look up about packing them and wrapping them up and i don't know i just keep thinking like what like i just keep thinking in my head that something bad's gonna happen because this year's just been full of rubbish so i just keep thinking all my run-ups like something's gonna happen i can feel it something in my bones something's gonna happen i can feel it because nothing good ever happens to me uh i just have a funny feeling something's gonna come at me um like towards the end of the year and then it's just gonna be utter crap you guys have any ideas that i could do for videos and stuff would be great i'm going to try and do a monologue at some point i've not had the energy be or the, the mind frame to start because of, like i said i keep getting migraines like two migraines a week so trying to learn a, a monologue right now was just not a no no so i'm going to try and do that if there are any if there are people watching that like monologues and if there's any specific one that you would like me to try and do you can leave it in the comments below also like what do you guys uh, let me know what you guys do at Christmas like leave them comments below like what do you have for breakfast do you have do you open your presents first and any breakfast what do you have for dinner what do you do in the meantime while dinner's cooking what do you drink do you have Prosecco and orange juice or do you just have normal alcohol <laughs> I know that we like to eat have um we like to open presents first and then we have breakfast which is like bagels or toast cream cheese salmon and scrambled eggs 
So what we like to do with some Prosecco and some orange juice. Um, yeah, so what kind of things do you guys like to do? Um, what, what do you want for Christmas? Like, I, I personally never ask for anything for Christmas. Like, I honestly never ask for stuff. Um, I know one thing I'm possibly getting, because my dad said when he was hammered, um, that he would pay for another tattoo for me. So I might be getting a tattoo after Christmas and New Year. I'm getting one on Friday, though. Yeah, I think it's the only present that I know I'm getting. Um, well, hopefully. Um... So, but like, what do you guys want for Christmas? Is there like any specific thing you want? Let me know in the comments as well. And just, I hope everyone does have a good Christmas. I'm sure I'll get into the Christmas spirit once we have the tree up. We have a few, like I said, we have a few decorations up, but hopefully I will get more into the Christmas uh, spirit once we actually do um, set the tree up and get all the lights and the living room decorated and like the hallway. So I will film something on Christmas day because um, we've got my dog a very big Christmas present this year. Um, I will, you guys will have to wait to Christmas to see that we've gotten something and we think he's going to go mental. <laughs> so hopefully he will and it'll make for a funny video. <laughs> hopefully over the next couple days I will try and learn a monologue and do it for you guys before then. I know that's a weird thing to do during December is do a monologue but if anyone knows any Christmas monologues again like I say leave comments in the comments below. Let me know if you guys want me to do a Christmas one. But yeah that's all I wanted to say guys. I just wanted to let you guys know where I am at right now because I think it's important even during Christmas period that to know that some people are just struggling and they're not feeling like they're not into Christmas spirit right now um but so I think it's important to share those things um specifically obviously because around these this time of holidays people get stressed it's called um what's it something depression what's it um seasonal depression I think that's what they call it but people do get stressed because they don't have the money they get stressed because there's no time um everything's just gets on everything just seems to get on top of people at christmas because they can't and especially probably this year because they won't have time to see family and friends they'll have to give them presents that maybe at a distance and they're not going to be able to see all, everyone that they want to see on christmas so check on your friends check on your neighbors your family just send someone a text if you think you haven't heard from them in a while just saying that you're thinking about them or you love them or you wish that wish them good health um so let's try and remember that for christmas time as well and also like my poundland were doing this thing where they were donating where like they could they scanned like they have like giant chocolate santas basically and uh when i was at the tail once they were wanting they were asking just to pay for the santa to go to the food bank so if you're poundland or anyone you know is doing that even if even if you only do it like once just maybe just say yes and it's only a pound for a giant chocolate santa and that could go towards a kid that doesn't get much at christmas and especially this time of year when everyone is struggling for money and maybe kids won't have something on Christmas but this might give them a bit of a smile on their face at Christmas so please remember to think about others as well. That's all I want to say so I hopefully will see you guys in another video. Take care everyone.